Hey guys, my name is Cam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be starting my third ever weekly haul and today I just have a few envelopes and then this one package. I don't really have too much to say for this intro so let's just get right into it. So we'll start off with this and it actually came in an envelope but I did unbox it yesterday but the note just says, Dear Cameron, thank you for trading Damon and Jisung with me. I hope they arrive to you safely. Please let me know when they do. From Evelyn at Che Wins. So the first thing that I traded for was Jisung's Wee Boom photo card and I believe that this does have a little circle mark indentation. Yeah, I think you can see it in the light. But I did trade one Chewang card for this and I also traded for the circle card you guys are about to see. So I thought that this was a fair trade. And yeah, there's the Jisung card. And I also traded for this Jamin Wee Boom Circle card as well. I do collect Lenjin from NCT Dream. I don't collect Jamin or Jisung, but I thought that I could possibly trade these to a Lenjin card that I still need. But yeah, there is the first envelope. Next up is this envelope, and the sticker is so cute. So the note just says, Thank you so much for trading. I hope Wendy got to you safe. Please let me know when you get this. From Olivia at Oh My Olive Trade and Sell, and I believe I traded with them on Instagram. So, as you can see, the photo card that I traded for was Wendy's Summer Magic Normal card, I believe. Oh my god, Wendy is so freaking cute. And when I saw this person have this card up for trade, I just decided to trade for her. I don't know if I'm going to collect OT5 for this set, but this Wendy card is so cute. I don't really know how many times I have to say that. Next up is this envelope all the way from Poland, and I really did think that this got lost since it took like two months to get here. So the note says, Hi, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Sulgi arrived to you safely. Good luck on your collection and stay healthy. From Jimmy Slamma Jamma on Instagram. So they included this freebie of Sulgi. This is such a cute photo of her. Thank you so much for this. And as for the actual card that I traded for, I got Sulgi's La Rouge photo book card. I'm so happy to finally have this card in my hands, but she's so freaking cute. I absolutely love the La Rouge photo book set. I think all of the girls' cards look so good. And yeah, here's the back. It's just a basic back, but she's so cute. Oh my God, her eye makeup, her necklace, her outfit, everything. She's so stinking cute. Finally, I have this group order package and I'll have to move all of these photo cards off to the side. So instead of going through Great Music CD like I normally do for Red Velvet Some Coex Goods, I decided to go through Happiness Group Orders on Twitter. I'll put their username right here, but yes, let's just go through all of this stuff one by one. This package did get a bit dented. So let's first go through this postcard set. So here's the back and the front. So I'll just do a flip through of these postcards. I do believe that the unit set is still available. I'll put all of the ability for all of the goods down here. But here's Irene's postcard. Sulgi, oh, I love this look on her. She looks so expensive. Another Irene. Sulgi. Irene, I absolutely love this color concept. And are those tomatoes? This horizontal Sulgi. Oh my god, and the water reflection concept. Oh, so stunning. And then we have the unit postcard. So there's the postcard book. I'll of course be separating those for my group order. And now let's go through these photo sets. So I'll start off with this one. So we have this unit photo, this Irene photo, and finally this Sulgi photo. Oh my god, they look so freaking good. I absolutely love all of the photo shoots they did for Monster, and I'm so happy that SM gave them so much content with all of these goods. Now we'll go through this photo set. This has these sun hats, which I absolutely love as well. So, of course, we have the sun hat photo, and then we have the water reflection set. So here's Irene's, so gorgeous. And then here's Silky's. So there are the photo and the postcard sets, and I'll move them off to the side now. Next, we'll be going through the sticker set. So as usual, they gave us this little plastic pouch with the zipper, which I really, really appreciate. I think it's probably the nicest SM packaging. And now we'll go through these stickers. So we have the unit, Irene. Oh, she's so pretty. Sulgi. Irene. Sulgi. 
another Irene. A Solgi. I actually got confused and thought this was Irene for a second since it has pink. Another Irene. Oh my god, this shot of her is so pretty. Solgi, another close-up. Ugh the yellow concept and then the sticker set pretty much repeats i believe that this is the glossy set yep it pretty much just repeats again so there are these sticker sets sorry it looks so haphazard and so unorganized but yeah the final thing that i have for this group order package is this perfume set i think that's what it's called like it's like a perfume kit or mask kit or something but basically both irene and sogi made a perfume set and they came with like a postcard sticker and photo i think so yeah let me just get right into it it did come a little damaged and opened but let's look at these contents it smells really good i have to say like it smells like flowers and berries looks like something is falling out here but here is a satchel Ooh, so i think all of the goodies are in here so i'll save that for last since that's probably the most exciting thing i don't think i should take this out actually i think like you put this in the satchel like that would make sense you put this in the satchel and then carry the satchel with you, but I really don't know the realistic purpose of this since I'm not going to be going around with like a satchel. Does this smell? Oh my god, it does. This little black thing smells so stinking good. I don't know how to describe it. It smells really sweet. I have to say like if you don't like sweet or like overpowering flowery scents, I probably wouldn't recommend this, but. And now let's get into these goodies, which is the main reason why I bought this. So first we have this little postcard of Sulgi. Oh, this is so pretty. I'm so happy that they did so many of these color concept photos for all of their merch. I think I said that before already. And then there's this black envelope. Oh my god, there's so many cards and goodies in here. So we have this guarantee card, I think. Yes, it's like thick, like an ID card. Just has her scent, black currant, laurel, and fit, 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 fit. I really don't know, but this is so cute. It has her little signature and it says scientist. I think that's so cute. And I absolutely love this photo again, just because it has the color concept. And it also comes with this photo card of both Irene and Sulgi. So that's actually really cute and really cool in my opinion that they did this. This is really different of SM. I don't really think I want them to do this again, just because this was like more expensive than the rest of this stuff. And I pretty much just bought it for these cards and the postcard, but it is an interesting concept, I suppose. So let me get everything back in the shot. So here's everything I received in this first clip of my weekly haul. I'm so happy to finally have all of my monster goods here in front of me. I'm only missing the light projection key ring. I still haven't ordered that and I probably should do that soon since the group order that I was going to go through closes soon. But yeah, let's get right into the next clip. Hey guys, this is going to be the next clip of this weekly haul. Um, as you can see, I only have one box. So this clip is going to be really, really quick. And I'm not really going to go super in depth with the contents of this box but i'm super duper excited for the item that's in here just because it's just something that i've wanted ever since i started collecting and i know that it's like a super rare thing if you collect red velvet or any other sm group for that matter you know that the thing inside of here is super duper rare and honestly it's just so exciting i can't believe that i ordered this i kind of have a story behind it and i'll tell it as i open it actually because i'm kind of wasting time but yeah let's just get right into it I already see the top of it and I'm so freaking excited. Whew, that was kind of a struggle to get out of the box. But as you can see, I got Red Velvet's Smile Box from 2018. And I purchased from this American eBay seller before. And basically a few days ago, they reached out to me and asked if I wanted this. And of course I said yes. Like, I just know that I'm never going to be able to find this again, especially the whole box intact and everything. And especially for the price that they were selling it, it was just such a good deal. I'm not going to disclose it here just because it was quite pricey, but... It was pretty good considering how much the cards and the postcards go for. But yeah, I got Red Velvet Smile Box. I can't believe that I'm saying this. And yep, if you're interested in seeing a formal unboxing of this, I'm sure that it's going to be up by now. And I'll try to remember to card it up here. But yeah, thank you so much to that eBay seller. And let's get into the next clip. Hey guys, so this is going to be the next clip of this weekly haul. 
Today I just have two envelopes and this larger package to get into and I'm really really excited for this. If you guys follow my Instagram, you probably saw me post about this a few days ago. But yeah, I apologize for any background noise or cricket sounds since my window is open since it's really really hot tonight. But yeah, let's just get right into these envelopes first. So we'll start off with this one with this really cute cat banana sticker. This card is so cute. So I kind of really struggled to open this up since they taped all of the sides of this. So I had to open it off of camera. But the note says, thank you for trading. I hope she reaches you fast and safe from Irene Monster on Instagram. P.S. Reusable. Um, I don't think I can really reuse this anymore since I cut it or like ripped it here. But I really do appreciate the thought. And I wish that more people would do this where they don't write on their greeting card so that other people can reuse it. But the photo card that I traded for was Wendy's finale card from the scrapbook version. I think that lighting is a bit better. But yes, I did already have this card, but I traded it to the final Irene scrapbook card I needed. So I needed to get back this Wendy. And yeah, she's so gorgeous. And this is probably one of my favorite Wendy cards from the set. Next up is this pink envelope. So the note says, hello, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Wendy arrives safely. Let me know when you get her. Also, I love your videos. Thank you so much. Good luck collecting. Have a nice day. Stay healthy from Toki Trade on Instagram. And oh my God, look at all the little characters they drew. This is Cinema Roll from Sanrio, Kiropi from Sanrio, and then a little bunny down here. That's so cute. And I really like your drawings and like all the effort you put into packaging. But let's get into these freebies first. So they have these little star stickers in here, but... Oh my god, there's this little bear sticker, so cute. Here's an Irene photo card. I think this is from a fan site actually. This is so cute. This is the iconic look from the Zimzilla Bim fan sign last year. There's this Wendy freebie from RBB. And finally, we have the Sulgi finale sticker. Thank you so much for all these freebies. They're really, really thoughtful. And yeah, thank you so much. So the photo card that I traded for was this Wendy finale card again, but this one is from the finale version. I think this is actually the final Wendy finale card that I needed to complete my set for her. So thank you so much for trading with me. I really, really appreciate it. Wendy is so gorgeous and I hope that she makes a super duper safe recovery. They just came out with an OST a few days ago with her voice in it, obviously. But yeah, thank you so much for trading with me. Now we'll get into the final item for this clip, which is this large bubble mailer. And I did open it earlier, but I just wanted to take a little peek at it, but I didn't actually take it out of the bubble wrap yet. You can already kind of see what it is. Oh my god, I feel like kind of like a clown for getting this, but it's just so cute and I really wanted a Sulky doll for a really, really long time. This is so stinking cute. Oh my god, I'll put the username that I bought this from down here. The seller was selling this for a really, really good price, like $20 plus shipping. And most of the time on Mercari Japan and eBay and stuff, these dolls typically go for like $40 or $50 each. Yeah, these dolls can get pretty expensive, including like EMS and like the doll, obviously, like pretty production costs she's so freaking cute the bear outfit and like the hair the little scarf is absolutely to die for and she'll look really cute on my shelf and i'm just so happy to finally have a sulky doll but yeah here's everything i received in the second clip of my weekly haul and let's get into the next one hey guys so this is gonna be the next clip of this weekly haul today i just have these three envelopes and this one bubble mailer to go through so let's just get right into it so as usual, we'll be starting off with the smallest one, which is this one. So the note just says, Hello Cameron, thank you so so much for trading with me. I am just starting to collect Leah cards and Unifoto cards, so I appreciate it. Thank you from Hal's K-pop page on Instagram and Hal the K-pop fan on Twitter. And as you can see, the photo card that I traded for was Joy's Summer Magic card. Let me actually adjust the lighting a little. Yeah, so I traded a Leah photo card for this Joy card since I am not collecting Leah anymore. So I decided to trade some of her cards to some red velvet ones. But yeah, thank you so much for trading with me. Next up will be this envelope. So there's actually a note inside of here and it says, Cameron, thank you so much for buying Dujin. I hope that she arrives safely. Please let me know when you get this. Stay safe, healthy, and happy from Sophia at Yuna's Trading on Instagram. 
and I did purchase one of Eugene's MMT pre-order photo cards. I think this is the second one. I think MMT put out like two or three different versions for like different rounds. But yeah, I got this one. It was really cheap, like $7. So I just decided to pick her up. I don't plan on collecting all of the pre-order benefits, but just ones that I can find for a decent price. But she's so stinking cute. Next, we have this larger and thicker envelope. So this note says, Hi Cam, thank you so much for trading with me. Let me know when the goods arrive. Hope you enjoyed the extra Irene for your collection from Gloria at Yontan Stan Trades on Instagram. I'm sorry if I butchered your name. What? You included an extra Irene? Oh my god, you're so sweet. And thank you for reaching out to me after watching one of my videos. So the first thing that I traded for was this Mark Super M card. This was actually a trade for my friend. I believe that they traded a Stray Kids card. I'm not really sure, but yes, I did get this Super M card of Mark. He's so stinking cute. And they included this freebie of Irene and Stolke. I'm not sure if this was the Irene they're talking about. Yeah, they included this really cute photo. Oh my god. So they included this extra standee of Irene from day one. She's so pretty. And I actually do not have this standee yet. So thank you so much, Gloria, for gifting this to me. It'll really help my own collection. Just so grateful for all of your support. And the other thing that I traded for was this Ryujin sticker sheet. I believe that I traded the Cheryong that I had that I said in my other video. But yes, I'm so happy to have this as well. Thank you so much, Gloria, for your support. I keep saying this, but thank you so much for your generosity and your support on my channel and this last bubble mailer is quite large so i'm going to move all of this off to the side oh my god that was so ugly the way that i did that So I have all of this larger stuff from Randy, also known as Che Bomb. Randy has been so kind to me and I just can't thank him enough for securing these trolls goods for me. He hosted a really large group order, like it wasn't just for me or anything, but I am really grateful that he was able to have a group order for these things. As you can see, I did get quite a bit of stuff. I'll just start going through it one by one. So I guess I'll start off with the non-photo card items. So I got this Trolls washi tape. I got two of them actually. I'm so happy to finally have these and they're so freaking pretty, oh my god. Because I actually don't have my own roll of washi tape. I've just been using samples that I've been gifted, but I'm so freaking excited to use these. They're so cute. There's this hollow one and this yellow one. Let me actually open one of these so you guys can see it. So here's this yellow one, it just has their little trolls designs, and I think this is from the Russian Roulette era trolls. And then we also have this hollow one, which just has their heads on them. This one is so pretty. I don't think you can see it in person, but the holo effect is really like glossy. And I also got the trolls sticky pad slash sticky note. But I also wanted to get a new stack of sticky notes for like trades and sales and stuff. But yeah, these are so cute. I believe that there's like 50 or 100 pages. It's, yeah, it's 100 pages. But yeah, these are so cute and I'm so excited to use these as well. Now we will start going through the photo card sets. So I got two of the Russian Roulette version, two of the Dum Dum version, two of the Summer Magic version, and then one of the denim sets since Randy wasn't able to secure them from his seller. But just going in chronological order, let's start with the Dum Dum set. Oh my god, there's so much stuff in here, but if I didn't say this already, I am hosting a group order or I held a group order for these cards, and I actually think that one of these sets is still available. Like, I only hosted a group order for one full set of them, and then there has to be another set for just these three sets. It's a little confusing, I'll kind of put like a message down here, but starting off with this Dum Dum set, we have Irene, Sulgi, Wendy, oh, she's so cute, Joy. And Yeti. My god, I'm so happy that SM gave us new pictures from these like eras since obviously they have these pictures and they should just be using them. And they also come with these clear frames. And finally, we have these little ID photos. This is my finger. It's like the size of my finger, basically. So we have Irene, 
Sogi, Wendy, Joy, and finally Yeti. So that was the Dum Dum set. And I will go through the Russian Roulette photo cards. And now we'll go through the Summer Magic set. And finally, we have the denim set, and this set was like the hardest one to get according to Randy since it was like the most popular, everybody was buying this one. And basically, I just have some extra sets for Dum Dum, Russian Roulette, and Summer Magic. So if anybody is interested in the member sets or just the full set of cards, feel free to DM me on Instagram. Why did I say that so weird? Feel free to DM me on Instagram. And last but not least, we have the pre-order benefit cards. So we have this holo card. This is actually just Randy's freebie. It's so cute. And then we have the first beat card. So this is Sogi's from Russian Roulette. And I do already have this since I bought it from Great Music CD just to secure her set just in case Randy wasn't able to get all of them. And we also have this Sogi Summer Magic one, which actually I was missing this. So thank you so much, Randy, for getting this Sogi card for me and helping me complete this set since people are already starting to charge like 50 or 60 dollars for these card sets so yeah thank you so much randy again for hosting this group order i really appreciate all of your communication and stuff so i'm not going to be able to get everything in the camera and i apologize for everything being so messy and disorganized but here's everything i received in this clip of my weekly haul and let's get into the next clip hey guys this is going to be the next clip of this weekly haul today i just have five envelopes so let's just get right into them so we'll be starting off with this envelope. Selena says, hello, thank you so much for trading. I hope Xiao Jun reaches you safely. Please let me know when you get this from Amanda at Velvet Namjoon on Instagram. So as you can see, I traded for Xiao Jun's yearbook photo card from NCT 2020 Resonance. Um, I think this card is so pretty. I actually traded my postcard that I pulled in one of my Target albums. So yeah, I just have this Xiao Jun photo card. Honestly, he owned this era. He owned Make-A-Wish, so I can't be that mad at having an extra card of him. Next up is this green envelope, or actually maybe it's blue. It's like blue-green. So the note says to Cameron, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Mr. Yang Yang arrives quickly and safely. Please let me know when he does. From Alyssa at Sniper Trades or Juhan Berry on Instagram. I think this is so funny, Mr. Yang Yang. I think I'm gonna start using that when I trade with people. So I did trade it for Yang Yang's photo card also from Resonance, and this is from the future version, I believe. <laughs> I believe that I traded my extra tail for this card, and then I actually already have a trade lined up for this Talenjin, but yeah, thank you so much for trading with me. Next up is this envelope. So the note says, Cam, thank you so much for trading with me. You really came through with the Yeti PC and I cannot thank you enough, love. Let me know when Renjun arrives from Holly. Oh, hashtag Zozovia 1k party. I actually just hit 1k a few days ago. I love you, Holly, so much. Holly is one of my mutuals here on Instagram and YouTube. She's just the freaking best. If you haven't subscribed to her, definitely check out her channel. I'll link it down below if I remember, but her channel name is just Holly Jolly and you should definitely follow her on Instagram as well. Holly2700. Good. 
But like I said, when I unboxed the Xiaojun yearbook photo card, I did end up trading for Lenjun's yearbook card as well. Basically, I got a Yeti Summer Magic PC, I think in one of the last clips of this haul. And basically, Holly collects Yeti, so I was just going to gift it to her. But then she pulled Lenjun, so it kind of turned into a trade, but... Yes, Holly pulled through with the Renjun photo card. So thank you so much, Holly. I love you. I think this entire clip is just gonna be NCT actually. But next we have this really pretty envelope with this really pretty tape. It's really gonna hurt me to rip this. <laughs> Oh my god, so the note just says, thank you for trading, let me know when you get this from Bujo Lucas Trades on Instagram. This washi tape is so cute and the card is cute as well. Oh my god, I did get another Renjun Resonance photo card. I really don't know how to say his name properly, like I hear people say Lenjun, Renjun, Denjun, like please correct me in the comments if one of them is right or wrong or if all of them are right, but I did trade for his glasses photo card from the past version. Oh my god, this is the future, right? Oh my god, I guess I'm just a clown, but... <laughs> I guess this is the future version actually. I got them mixed up. I guess I just associated the yellow color with the past and blue with the future. I'm not really sure why, but yeah, I did get Renjun's future photo card. I have to make sure I get that right, but oh, I love this card so much and thank you so much for trading with me. Finally, we have this envelope and I actually don't really know what this is. Oh my god, is this like a top loader that's broken and they taped it? That's so funny, but the reason why I said what is because I didn't know that this person sent out this card because I'm supposed to be trading this Yang Yang card with them, but this got here really fast and I didn't think that they sent it out, but yes, I did get this Lenjin photo card from the past version. He looks stunning in this one as well. Obviously, I think the glasses one is superior, but this one is pretty cute as well, but it's really cool that my Renjun collection is already complete for this era. Honestly, I was kind of stressing out originally because in general, NCT photo cards, they honestly kind of go for too much for what they are. But thankfully, since the albums were in Target, it was really easy to find some American and citizens. But yes, I was able to secure my Renjun set. So here's everything I received in this clip of my weekly haul, as well as my full Renjun set for Resonance. And let's get into the next clip. Hey guys, this is going to be the final clip of this weekly haul. I'm using air quotes because technically it's been like two weeks since I started filming this haul. But yeah, today I have a envelopes with a variety of trades and purchases. And I actually have this card, which I'll go through first. But it is Lenjin's Reload Kino photo card. And I actually bought this for my friend Chiba, also known as July here on YouTube. You should definitely go follow and check out her YouTube. And basically, she came and dropped this off to me after buying it for me on Thai Twitter. So yeah, definitely go follow and check out her account. Thank you so much, Chiba, if you're watching this. But yeah, let's get straight into these envelopes. I'll start off with the smallest one over here. So the note just says, Cameron, hi there. Thank you so much for joining my group order and being patient. I hope that Yujin arrives to you quickly and safely. Please let me know when she does. P.S. I love your YouTube channel. Love Ava at AP199722 on Instagram. Thank you so much, Ava. I really appreciate all of your support. But I did join a group order for the showcase stickers from their Itzy showcase tour when they came to America and like they toured the world. Yeah, this is the sticker set. There's this round one, this one, her name, and then also this one from Dala Dala era since their tour was actually earlier this year before Wannabe era. But yeah, thank you so much again for hosting this group order. Um, I'm not planning on collecting all of Ryujin's non-album just because some of her cards and like Polaroid things are really expensive I've seen. So yeah, I'll just pick up whatever I can find pretty much. Next up will be this envelope. So the note just says, Hello Cameron, thank you so much for trading with me. Please message me at Hello Trades when Yeti arrives safely. I hope you have a great day. Please take care of yourself. And here's their signature, and I absolutely love the little hearts and stars. 
But as you can see, I traded for Yeti's The Velvet photo card. I believe that I traded an Ice One photo card for this. But yeah, she's so pretty. Oh my god. Basically, I just wanted to trade a bunch of my cards to some red velvet ones. So I reached out to this person to see if they wanted to trade, and they did. So thank you so much for trading with me, Hello Trades. Next up is this envelope, and I'm actually super excited to get into this one since it's actually my first gift. They wrote arigato on here, which just means thank you in Japanese. Oh my god! Okay, a bunch of stuff fell out on the ground, but I'll pick everything up really quickly. So I took everything out of the card, but it just says, Cameron, thank you so much for giving Lenshin a new home. I hope he reaches you quick and safe. I also want to thank you for getting me into collecting. I love your channel and always look forward to your content. And good luck on your senior year. I'm in the same boat, lol. Hashtag class of 21 things. Anyway, stay safe and healthy and happy collecting. Love, Kimoni, also known as Moon Kim on Instagram. Thank you so much. And yep, we're all struggling here, class of 2021. I hope I don't sound rude when I say this, but honestly, class of 21, Oki got it harder than class of 2020. Like our whole year got canceled. All you class of 2020 people, y'all didn't have it as bad, okay? But they did decorate this top loader with these really cute sticky notes. So they were really generous. And I have this Irene photo, Sogi. I think this is Taeyong, a Totoro sticker, a photo of Lisa, a photo of, I think this is Everglow, yeah. This is Everglow. Another photo of Irene. And then Sogi. This is actually my favorite photo from Summer Magic. So thank you so much for these really generous, generous freebies. And there's also this sticker. So thank you so much for those. So as you can see, the photo card that they gifted was Lenjin's We Go Up photo card. Oh my god, I was honestly kind of struggling to find his We Go Up card, but thankfully Moon pulled through with this card. Basically, they joined a group order for another Lenjin card, I think, and then they were actually sent this one by accident. So they decided to give this one to me since they already had it, I believe. But thank you so much for thinking of me. It's really helping my Lenjin collection out. And yeah, he's so stunning here. But next we have this envelope. This card is so pretty, but the note says, Hi there, thank you so much for buying Sappy's, oh my god, what did I say? Irene's Sappy photo card for me. I hope she reached you quickly. Stay safe and healthy from KSG Trades on Instagram. And this washi tape is so cute. It's actually Kuromi, I think, from Sanrio. So the note said it and you guys just saw it pretty much, but I did buy Irene Safi photo card since this was the last Japanese one that I needed and it was less than $15. So I was like, I might as well get it since Safi is kind of hard to find, but yep, I do have this Irene photo card. So thank you so much for selling her to me. Next up will be this envelope. So the note says, hi Cameron, thank you and your friend for trading with me. I hope Mark arrives safely. Stay safe and healthy from Levanters on Instagram. So as the note stated, this card is from my friend. So basically my friend had a bunch of cards up for trade to like Mark, Jaehyun, or Taeyong cards. So this was one of the cards on her wish list and I believe that I traded a Sungmin card. Yep, it's Mark's regulate card. I think this is one of my favorites in the set. He's so stinking cute with the P sign. Loki wanna clock Mark. But thank you so much for trading with me, Levanters. And also thank you so much for this white sleeve. I actually just ran out of these. So I really appreciate it when people send me white or black sleeves. Next up is this envelope. Ooh, okay. So the note just says, hello, thank you so much for trading with me. Hope Irene reaches you quickly and safely. Please let me know when you get this from Starlight Mitsu on Instagram. So as you can see, I finally got my hands on Irene's sticker set from the Monster album. I think this is from the Top Note version, but yep, here's her sticker set. I'll just go through them really quickly. So I finally did trade one of my 10 million Sogi sticker sets. Happy to have Irene's, I guess. It wasn't really too high on my priority list, but I saw this person have them up for trade, so I decided to trade with them. Next up will be this envelope.
So the note just says, Cam, hello, hope this car makes it to you quickly and safely. Thank you so much for trading with me and collecting this cute Taeyong. Please let me know when this reaches you. Also, congrats on 1K. Stay safe and healthy. Be happy as well. From Veronica and their Instagram is Ki Hyun Ho's. Thank you so much for that really cute message congratulating me on 1K. And let's go through these freebies first, actually. So we have this photo of Ryu Jin from Wannabe. Oh my god, her buns are so cute. This photo of Tail. Oh my god, Mark with his messy hair. And then these stickers of these cookies and this camera. Thank you so much for these freebies. I really appreciate it. But as you can see, I did trade for this Taeyong photo card, and this is from the past version. So happy to have a Taeyong card since he is my bias in NCT 127. I'm definitely not going to collect his cards. I just decided to trade for this one since I had an extra Xiaojun. So happy to have Taeyong. Thank you so much for trading with me. And the final envelope slash package for this entire weekly haul will be this blue one. So the note just says, thank you for training with me at Diamond Rose Dust. Oh my god, I think I forgot to send their stuff out. Oh my god, I'm such a bad person. But they did duct tape it in here like this, which is very unique. Ooh, okay, I thought I was gonna bend her because that duct tape was really sticking to the top loader or the sleeve. But I did trade for this Yeti photo card. She's from the finale. She's so freaking cute. So here's everything I received in this final clip of my weekly haul. And I'm just gonna bring everything from all of my clips into the frame for my outro. So here are all of the photo card size items that I received in all of the clips of this weekly haul. Thank you all so much for staying to the end of this video and to anybody who bought or sold or traded with me. And yeah, that pretty much brings me to the end of this video. This final shot looks so nice on camera. But yeah, thank you all so much for all of your support. This video probably won't go up until like late November because I don't know I have a lot of videos to film and post and it's actually the first day of November so I hope you guys had a nice November but yeah I'll stop rambling and let you guys go as usual don't forget to like comment and subscribe stay safe stay healthy stay loud and I'll see you in my next video peace